Hello friends, good morning. Today I am coming up with new topic on payroll and this time Odoo offers payroll based on three ways in the contract. Let's see how it works. So basically when we are running any payroll it requires a contract. So on the contract if we schedule how the work entry source would be according to work entry source Odoo will calculate the payroll but here the business requirement is we need to pay our employee based on his timesheet but we don't have any option based on you know timesheet so I would like to offer a workaround so that workaround may not be uh, you know convenient to all but it's a workaround so let me explore how you know timesheet based payroll will work so it's not actually based on timesheet but what i would like to propose here if we allow the work entry source as a planning and then define hourly wages okay and schedule pay would be monthly over here and let's say my pay plan is 20 us dollar per hour and the employment type is full time and then the employee is Mustafa Rahi over here and then his you know contract starts somewhere from January 1st and working schedule would be 40 hours standard per week and work and resources planning but which type is hourly so how we can now generate the payroll based on this planning and resource so here the wage is hourly but how I will be going to pay to this particular employee based on hourly based on you know timesheet so timesheet is a separate parameter but if I plan my employee to work on certain hours per week and per month then only I will be able to generate based on planning so how it will work so what we will do we will generate first planning so in the planning what happens like for every week you know I am making some plan so let's say from 24 to 28 March I am planning 20 hours for this particular candidate so likewise if I have planned you know 20 hours then you know 16 hours then 32 hours and 12 hours in span of four different weeks so totally I have planned 80 hours for this particular candidate so now what happens is candidate will come according to this planning and fill up his time sheet based on allocated task because during planning also what we will do we can attach the sales order item over here which I have already sold and now this employee is working on that particular task so I have planned only 80 hours for this particular candidate to work during entire month now based on this planning if I want to generate my work entries so what I will do is you know for this particular month if I say regenerate work entry and for this Mustafa Rahi from 1st March to 31st I want to generate work entries so it will generate work entries based on all this you know planning okay so 12 32 16 and 20 worth 80 hours of planning is already added now what happens is if I want to generate pay slip it will go and create one pay slip based on the number of days and days are comprising of hours so number of hours are 80 multiply by 20 it will generate the payroll based on 80 hours of planning so planning can convert into timesheet which the employee has to fill up on his uh, you know task and then we can generate the payroll based on the planned hours so this is the one way may not be uh, you know 100% alignment but yeah it's a alternative now second I uh, think what I would like to propose is the similar way if I am running payroll and my contract type is definitely based on attendance so again if I set the employee payroll to run based on attendance and it is again connected with hourly wages so let's say for this employee too my hourly wage is 10 us dollar per hour and the payroll should run based on attendance 
so how it will work this time so what we have seen is we have generated planning earlier now this time we will go and focus on attendance so what we will do is we will see the attendance data of this particular employee too so what i am going to do is i am generating the attendance for this particular employee so if i say on third he has signed in around 10 on third we signed in around 16 hours so it will generate five hours based on the work schedule so now he again came on 9th and on 9th he signed in at 11 and on that's a 9th was Sunday so yeah this is January so January 9th he signed out around 17 hours so according to this time he worked again 5 hours now then why again he came on 14th and then on 14th January he started somewhere around 11 and on 14th let's say he closed around 13 hours so based on you know uh, like working schedule his you know time log is 11 to 1 or 11 to 12 because 12 to 1 is you know the break so now I have generated uh, let's say only this many hours for my employee to almost 18 hours so let me just check this to make it perfect count now I have generated 18 hours of his attendance in the month of January now what happens is based on you know my work entries if I go to month of January and I generate my time for employee 2 it will generate you know based on the attendance now what happens is in the work entry for the month of January and I generate pay slip so pay slip will be generated based on total number of days counting 23 hours means 2.87 days he worked and according to 23 hours he will be eligible to pay get pay of 229.96 us dollar so this is how you can generate even based on his real attendance and calculating that attendance into hourly wages so this is not timesheet based but attendance plus hourly you know combination you can generate this type of payroll for your employee who are working you know based on either timesheet based on planning okay so timesheet is irrelevant here but attendance with hours will be calculated over here and then we can calculate their payroll according to work schedule according to attendance that is one way and second way is according to the planning on the task so hope this workaround may fit in certain scenario may not fit but yeah i wanted to present how the pay slip can be generated based on you know uh, hourly uh, or you know not timesheet but hourly type uh, you know creation of payroll based on attendance and based on planning which can be equally created uh, you know entries like timesheet hope uh, you guys may you know set up somewhere this particular payroll rule and get benefited. Thank you.